Alright, so it is January 1st, 2013, and I haven't made a video in a little while, a vlog. Um, I want to do better about that. There for a while I was making them really consistently and all, but that's the problem with me. I'm a procrastinator on one hand, and I have ADD on the other, so I do something for a while and then it kind of falls off. Especially if I don't have, like, a group of people or somebody that is pushing me to do stuff and asking questions and I'm getting really involved in like a community type feel, things like that. It seems like I, I start questioning whether it's worth it or not, even if I like doing it. Um, and I know I should just do it because I like doing it and you know that should be the main reason that I do it. That is the main reason why I do it because if you look back at any of my videos, most of them have maybe two views or, you know, four or five or something like that. And then a couple of them have, you know, a hundred or a couple hundred. But those are usually either news-related or a fluke. Um, so that's that. Because I don't really do sketch comedy and things. I just, I talk about the things I'm thinking about and I ask questions. And most people just want to be entertained. They don't want to think. Um, so that's, that's kind of what happened here. But today is January 1st. And, of course, we're all hearing about resolutions and things like that and making a lot that we won't ever follow up on or anything like that. I would like to, you know, make my own resolutions and actually follow through with them. And I have so many things that I want to do. I know it's not possible to do them all. Um, and I want to do something really well. I want to be the go-to guy for, you know, something. It's just what? Because um, I like woodworking. I like writing. You know, I like the medical field. That's what I do for a living. Um, I like photography. Um, I like making videos. You know, I like reading. Um, well, I like learning. You know, just all kinds of things. So it's like, what do I choose to focus on? Or what couple things? Um... So I did write out a couple um, kind of resolutions. Um, I'm not good about saying, yes, I'm going to do this and actually following through. Unless there's somebody you know, there with me saying, yeah, I'm going to do it too and you know, back each other up. I don't have um, anyone like that. So some of the things that I would like to do this year. Um, I would like to sell my first photograph, not the first photograph that I took, just I would like to sell a photograph that I take to somebody for real money, um, you know, just to say that I've, I've done that and maybe be able to continue to do that. And what I was thinking about along with that is, since I have the whole My Needy Nation thing, if you don't know about it, you know, MyNeedyNation.com, or well, actually, .org now, you can type in .com and it'll take you to it, um, but .org, and that is kind of like a community that I started and what we have done for the past two years is do it. we've done a Secret Santa project where we've um, tried to raise some money and we find out about a family whether it's um, a mother and her child or mother and children or an entire family or an individual and we raise money and we have found out what kind of things they like from people that know them and we don't let them know anything about it and we surprise them, you know, just before Christmas, like a week or so before Christmas. Um, and, you know, and give them the gifts and things like that and talk to them and things like that. So, we would like to do that, but we don't want to just do that for Christmas. We want to do that, you know, throughout the year. The only problem is not having enough uh, funds to do that. Um, of course, money. Seems to always be about money, doesn't it? Um, unfortunately. But it does take money to, you know, provide the things that we need in life. And for a lot of the things that we like, you know, it, it costs money too. Um, the most important things, it doesn't though. Like the time with your family and friends and enjoying what you do and things like that. So, we want to be able to do things more often throughout the year. Either random times when nobody's expecting it. Which I think that means a little bit more than doing something just at Christmas time. Because people expect you know, some, you know, cheer and joy and gift-giving and things like that around Christmas and holidays. But what about the other times? What about, you know, like March 5th or, 
you know, like September the second, or you know, just not a holiday, just a day, because we all we all like to have something brighten up our day, or you know, our week, or whatever, just out of the blue, something unexpected. So we'd like to do that, but without funds and you know donations, whatnot, we can't really do that because we can't afford to you know put our own money into every single thing that we do. You know all of you know, put our money into the entire project. Um, we always give something, or you know, whatnot. So there's that. I want to do um, that. I want to get that, get more involved with that, um, and put things out there throughout the year, um, rather than just around Christmas time. So that's one goal. Um, photography. I don't know how I got from photography over to that, but. There's that. I want to learn more about photography. I want to sell my first um, first photo this year. Um, I want to do something for my wife. I've already got some plans and uh, got some things together that I need for that, but that won't be done until the end of the year. And then, <clears throat> what else did I say I wanted to do? Um, make more uh, woodworking projects. I did a couple of this last year. One of them was for my wife. It was the box um, that she liked very, very much. So I'd like to do some more woodworking projects, and I have some lined up, like beds for the kids and you know a cradle for the new baby and things like that. So I've got some of those lined up. I'd like to do that. Um, I would like to make uh, make some friends that I actually you know keep in touch with. Any friends that I've had from high school, you know we don't really talk anymore, you know, we'll maybe say hi or happy birthday or something on Facebook, you know, that kind of thing, um, but I don't really have any close friends that I talk to on a regular basis, my sister would be the, well, my wife and my sister would be the closest things to that, um, oh, I probably should have written some things down before I started this vlog, but, you know, I'm, that's how I'd like to do it, I just like to talk, um, for me, and that's probably why I don't have a lot of people that watch my videos because I don't plan everything out. It doesn't have good lighting. I use my iPhone to do it, but that's you know just just me. You know, I like to be spontaneous. I don't like to have everything planned out. Some things are good to have planned out, and other ones I like it better when they're not planned. So, you know, photography, my needy nation, um, the photography thing. I'm getting ready to buy a domain name. Um, I have a blog on WordPress for my photography stuff. And I'm thinking about buying a domain name and just having it point to that uh, that blog uh, for now. And maybe someday, you know, if I sell some uh, photos and things like that, I can actually get the, uh, the website hosted and you know, actually have an actual website rather than a blog that it goes to. Um, so there's there's that. Um, you know, maybe on another vlog I'll, I'll go back and I'll look at what I actually wrote and go over some of those things. I think there were six um, total. You know, one was making friends, one was selling my first photo, one was doing more with the uh, My Needy Nation stuff, um, one was doing more woodworking projects. So that's kind of a recap for you. So there's that. Um, and, yeah, I think that's it for, for now. This is going on nine minutes, so I'll let you go. Um, comments, questions, concerns, anything down in the comments below, as usual. I'll put some links to some things, um, in the description. Uh, so yeah, I'll talk to you next time.